Hi, I'm Randy Kessingham with spectacular news from This Is True. Peter Albert, 52, accepted a plea bargain after an incident in Anchorage, Alaska. Albert had tried to rob someone of their watch with a spork, which the newspaper helpfully explained is a combination fork and spoon, and if that's not clear enough for readers, it also noted sporks are a hybrid fork-spoon utensil. Thwarted when he couldn't get the watch band's catch to release, Albert stabbed his victim and then ran off, leaving a number of Kentucky Fried Chicken products at the scene of the crime. To avoid a possibly longer sentence, Albert, who police say was drunk at the time of his crime, pleaded guilty to assault with a deadly weapon and will serve one year in jail. In other news, domestic airlines have been thrown into chaos now that sparks have been declared deadly weapons. <laughs> Back off, I've got a spark! Shouldn't KFC's food be considered much more deadly? That'll teach you to call for a second take. 